Hello YouTube, call me a Soviet here, playing some TDM, I think, this game on Resistance, using the Type 95 Silence Frags, Stun Grenades, and yep, this game I go, like, 32 and 4, and I do amazing, you'll see, anyway, so killstreaks are Care Package, Attack Helicopter, no, Care Package, Predator, and then A86 Overwatch, so... I'm going to be commentating, and as I'm commentating right now, I'm, I'm actually playing a game with my friends of Mom Free 3, so, yeah, I might I might, I might not be the most focused person right now, or you might hear gunshots in the background, because I'm sniping at the Barrett. Anywho, I've started working on my montage for this game, and I think it's going to look nice. I got multi-kill the other day, and then I got a triple kill with the Barrett today, so... It's going well. In other news, uh, thank you for all the views I've been getting lately on all the subscribers there. I really appreciate it. And then, also, watch my tactics in this game. So, here's my tactic help for all you below average players or just average, how to get above the, to the above average level of gaming. So, first off, what I do is I pinpoint the hotspot of the map. After that, you want to pinpoint who's there, your teammates or the enemy team. So depending on where, on who's there, if it's your team, then you want to move away from that area and go to the outside spawn of the map, of, of the enemy spawn. And you want to control it, and I prefer using a silencer once you're there. You can start spawn killing them, as I'm doing here right now. And the reason why I say use a sound is because then no one knows your position, which is always nice. Last off, um, I mean, yeah, so just kill them like that. Also, when the enemy is in the main area, I prefer not using a sound, I prefer using a more powerful, powerful gun. So I'd use like the ACR, and you just wanna you wanna move along the sides of that outside area of the map. And then you want to try to get in and control the entryways from which they're coming. So that might not be that might sound a little bit more difficult, but a good map example for you guys is Hard Hat. If you played on Hard Hat, you want to go control that center. Then you want to pinpoint which entrances they will go from, and then you want to have you and your teammates watch the entries because usually there's more than one entry which they come in. Um, next, so that's my tactic there. And if you're watching this, you'll notice me doing that. And the reason I have the care package out is because, uh, what's it called? Because I was trying to get the daily challenges to care packages nice and easy. I get it in one game. So, yep. Next off, what else? Oh yeah, just prestige in Mom for 3. And it feels really nice. And what I've noticed from my previous prestige, well, my unprestiged, uh, area was I didn't use the salt kill streak at all. I only use the support. So this first siege, I think I'm gonna go with the uh, assault. And the reason being is because, in my opinion, the support the support pack uh, kill streaks kind of kind of water you down because you don't really learn how to stay alive. You just go out for the kills for the points. The assault, you gotta learn your tactics, you gotta learn where the enemy's gonna be, you gotta be more cautious. So, and using this assault, uh, the assault, kill streak, sorry, has been actually boosting my KD as well, which is always nice. So, what happened to my KD is trying to go for montage clips, like purposely, and never do that because you can't go for montage clips, they just happen. So, long story short, my KD went down to 1.08, and right now it's about, it's a 1.30 right now, so that's a big improvement, and that's only been over the course of two days, and it's still going up, that's not, I don't get 1.30 every game, it's still going up, and I'm gonna start giving out more tips for you guys, cause playing with the average players, looks like you guys need a lot more help, well, I don't know if it's you exactly, but you know what I'm saying. People need help when playing this game. No common sense in whatsoever. Oh, no, sorry, I just got owned in the game. But anyway, thanks for watching my video. I don't know how much is left of this commentary, but I'm um, looking at down at it, not that 
like half or 75 percent of the way done so if you guys have any questions for me or whatever please tell me I know this isn't this isn't the best commentary but this is a damn good game I I, I swear I almost giggled at the end of this game because I was like damn that's a good game just prestige and that's what happens hell yeah and then you might see oh yeah, I use the Reaper in this gameplay so if you notice in the re uh, that's like my second time using the Reaper I was completely confused I thought it was just like an AC-130 so apparently I have to follow that red dot and that's what that's what's going on with me and I'm sorry this isn't the most entertaining commentary you've ever seen but no this is just me com talking about my life my Call of Duty life so I'm sorry if you're disappointed I'm not disappointed just watch the gameplay and just watch and compare compare yourself to the game the here is actually what is the best tip I can say when you're playing picture yourself pl uh, being that if you were the enemy what would you do to kill yourself well not kill kill like suicide but to kill the other team and then pinpoint the mistakes you've made so I'll get into detail more about that next time I talk about it. And I might do, go into map details because I've noticed every map has this little trick on it. Unlike Black Ops. Oh, well, Black Ops changed, but I wasn't hardcore into Black Ops. Well, I can't, after buying this game, I can't believe I played that game or touched it. This game is just so much better. Well, in my opinion, people say this game sucks, so they're kind of crazy. So, thanks for watching my video. Please give it like, comment, subscribe. I'll like that. And it looks like we're winning by like 20 kills. 18 kills, I think. And then, um, sorry, my throat's a little bit dry, so I drink water when I play. But when I game, I just try to spend the most time possible gaming. Because I'm a no life like that. And it took me a little bit less than a day to prestige for people that want to know. Which is pretty fast, actually. So, in my opinion, that's fast. Only a day of game time, so two weeks. I, I wasn't playing this game hardcore, like, only play this and this. Uh, I'll play whenever I can. I had a ton of school and studying to do. So, here's a final kill. I'm coming up right here. I picked up a sniper, hopping my way out. And thanks for watching. Peace out.